this you want to install music through SpotDL. So this is a quick guide, um, just a visual recap of, of this, since some people uh, might find this confusing. So first thing, we have some prerequisites. We need Visual Studio. Um, so we need the C++ library. So what you have to do is you can click on this. I'll have it linked. And you're going to go ahead and install it. Um, so you have it on your on your PC, right? So once you've installed that, make sure to also install Python. And very important, on the Python installer, you're going to have to click Add Python Path. you got to have the path. So make sure you click both of the boxes and add the path. I'll have this link down below as well. All right. Next, um, you're going to have to install FFmpeg and add the path, which is kind of difficult. But don't worry, I'll show you how to do it exactly. So go ahead and download it from this GitHub right here. All right. Let's say you have it downloaded. It's going to be a zip file. Um, so if you have WinRAR, that's good. Install WinRAR if you don't have it. And run, um, make make a new folder. You can name it whatever you want. It doesn't matter. Um, but I don't I don't need it. I made a folder right here. Make sure you extract the WinRAR the zip file. Extract it into the folder you just made. It doesn't matter where it is on your PC because we're gonna be adding the path. So yeah, it doesn't really matter. Okay, make sure you extract it. Then copy this path right here at the top. And then on your Windows search, search for path. Then you're going to click and you're going to get this window. You're going to have to click on environment variables. And then you're going to see this window. Then here you see path. Click on that. Here, click on new. and then. The path you just copied, it doesn't have to be the same one. Whatever you copied at the top with these files inside, make sure you paste that in here. As you can see, I have it right here. So I'm going to hit cancel, but you're going to hit OK. Right, now you have it added to your PC so it can recognize it. Go back to the installer page and copy this command right here. This is after you install Python, after you install everything, copy this command. Here, open CMD, paste this. You can also run this command right here and you can update it. Okay, we already installed FFmpeg. So it's fine, you don't have to do that. All right, now everything should be installed. And on here, you should now, under users, under your username, I'm pretty sure you should see this folder right here. Now you can go back, go to your FFmpeg folder, copy the exe, just copy it and then go back into the spot DL folder and paste it. Right here, paste it. All right. Now let's say you've done everything correctly. Go to your music or whatever you want to install it. And let's make a new folder so it's all organized. Here you can now type cmd. It's going to open this command prompt right here. Now you should be able to do this. To do this. And you should see that it's... Oops. You should see that it shows up with a path. Shows up with ffmpeg, everything like this. You can download lyrics, everything. All right. But what we want to do is we want to download a song or a playlist for that matter. 
So let's go to Spotify, copy whatever you want. I'm just going to copy this for an example. It doesn't matter. It can be whatever you want. Anything. And go back. Here, now you can type spot dial again, space. And then let's say you copied the song. You copied the, the link. And now you're going to hit enter. It's going to fetch for the song. And it's going to start downloading the song. You can see it finished downloading. And now you can open it. That's basically how to use this. And now you can connect your phone or your MP3 player or whatever you have. And um, you can listen to music offline. So the cool thing about this as well is it downloads the cover art. And like I said, there's more commands. Um, if you need lyrics or anything. And yeah, enjoy guys.